There is one very simple thing that any ebay.com seller should implement and activate in their store and this is the global shipping program on ebay. I don't know why but I see sometimes sellers, ebay dropshippers or general ebay sellers who don't activate this program when they work with US suppliers. I cannot understand this and in this video I will explain you why it's so important to activate this program and why you will get immediately at least 10% more in sales when you activate the global shipping program on eBay. I will also go over everything that you need to know to work at the right way using this program and everything that you need to know to implement it right now. Short intro and we are starting. Hello everybody, before we get started I want to show you how we came to create this video about the global shipping program. So. Around a few weeks ago, we listed this poll on our Facebook community and we saw there that more people are not using the global shipping program than the amount of people who actually use that. And also we saw that some people even don't know what is this program. And it was really sad for me because it's a huge loss for these sellers and it's really important to implement it because I think it's the easiest way to get at least 10 percent more in sales to your stores because you don't need really to make a lot of work there just to, cho to choose something on eBay's site and you're ready to go. So let's see how to work with the global shipping program and why it's so important. So first of all let's understand what is the global shipping program of eBay. The global shipping program is basically a warehouse of eBay where what you do is that you send the products directly to their warehouse and then they shipping it worldwide. Why it's helpful? Let's say that you're doing dropshipping from Amazon.com and you want to ship to worldwide. How could you do that? So maybe you could send it directly from Amazon to some different countries, but the problem is that Amazon doesn't always support all of the countries and you cannot know that before the buyer buys from you. So this is why the eBay's global shipping program is very beneficial for us. What we can do is that we just clicking on activating the global shipping program on our policy and I will show you soon in this video how to do that right. And then when a buyer from another country, for example from Ukraine, comes to buying from your US store, they will see how much this product will cost if you ship it directly to them they will pay the shipping price and you will send the product directly to eBay's warehouses which is the address that eBay will give you in these cases and eBay will send it to the customer. Why it's good? Let's see. This is a site that's called similarweb.com. This site shows you the traffic to a specific site. So I went to eBay.com and, so, and I wanted to check how much of eBay's traffic comes from the United States. And let's see what I saw. So if I scroll down here, I can see that there are 940 people who goes to eBay every month and there are only 80% of them who are from the United States. It means that we have 0.2, which is 20%, multiplied by 240 million. It means that we have 188 million people who we don't sell them if we don't use the global shipping program. So basically everyone who doesn't ship worldwide, they just missing 188 million people who are possibly can buy from their stores. This is why from our statistics in Autodesk we see an improvement of sales by 10% up to 20% for people who use the global shipping program over those who doesn't use. It means one of 10 products will sell to international buyer. So I hope that it's clear why it's so important to use the global shipping program. Now let's try to understand how to activate it and how does it work. So the first thing that I will do is that I will go to eBay and I will click here on um, my account, account settings. Then I will go to site preferences.
I will scroll down here until I see here the shipping preferences. And I will check that the global shipping program is enabled here. If it's disabled, just enable it so you will be able to implement it into your policies. The second step will be to go to my policy, which is just go again to account settings. Go here to business policies. Choose your policy. I will take my US shipping policy. And scroll down. Choose this, this checkbox. Send it to the US shipping center. The rest will be taken care of by us for you. So just check this and save. After we did that, when a buyer will come to your listing, they will see the shipping price, the estimated shipping price directly to their location. And when they add the product to cart and want to pay you, they will see the final shipping price. How will we calculate it? Using the weight in your listing. This is something which is critical. You need to remember to add the product weight directly to your listing so eBay will give the right pricing to your buyers. Something important in AutoDS, if the, your supplier has these dimensions, we will also attach it to your listing. Now, let's see some other interesting things about the global shipping program. So, first of all, who pays the shipping price? Of course, only the buyer pays. All what you as a seller pay, paying is the fees to PayPal and fees to eBay. About the benefits of it. First of all, eBay shows here that the good thing here is that if you provide the domestic shipping for free and you're sending it directly to eBay's uh, warehouses, you will get five stars for shipping costs directly to your feedbacks, which is amazing for us and will improve our positive feedbacks. The second thing here is that if you send it quickly, up to four business days and within one handling time days, uh, which is possible if you work with Amazon, you will also get five stars <coughs> for uh, the shipping. The next thing here is that if something will happen with the shipping during the time that uh, eBay ships it to the customer, you will be covered and any negative feedback or natural feedback will be removed by eBay because they handled the shipping and they know if the product arrived to the customer or didn't arrive to the customer. One more thing that you need to remember, when you provide the tracking number, you need to provide the tracking number of the international shipping. It means that you don't provide to your customer the tracking number which is inside the United States, but you provide the one that eBay gives you for the global shipping. Important thing here is that you need to remember that this policy and this program is only for ebay.com and only for products that are located, located inside the United States. If you work with Chinese suppliers, it's irrelevant and there I just recommend you to work with the worldwide shipping uh, policy and worldwide uh, shipping directly from your Chinese supplier. It will be much more uh, it will be much cheaper for you, much faster for your customers, and this is the right thing to do. I hope that this video is clear for you, and one last thing that I want to show you. If you go to your policies, and you go to the returns policy, you have here the international uh, returns. So in this case, I really recommend you to write that the return will be paid by the buyer and not by the seller because in these cases it can be much more expensive for you to pay for the returns. So don't forget to choose here that the buyer will pay the returns for international shipping. This will save you a lot of money, headache and make your life much easier. I hope that this video is clear. Don't forget to like this video, share it with your friends, other dropshippers, other eBay sellers, subscribe to our YouTube channel and ask me anything that you would like to know about e-commerce or dropshipping in the comments below this video. I promise to go and answer any of your questions by myself. This is what I want to do to help you to succeed as dropshippers and make more money. See you in the next videos. Bye-bye.